terrible fix. Well, yeah, like we gotta raise three whole dollars to get Petey the Pup out of the pound. But that mean old dog catcher's gonna put on the sleeve. Three whole dollars? Where are we ever gonna get that kind of dough? Come on, everybody, check your pockets. I I got seven cents! Um, I got a nickel. I got three cents and a dead mouse. Oh. Hey. Jeepers, guys, we gotta figure out a way to raise some money. Like how, Maggie? I don't know, Pinky. Well, come on, everybody, let's put on our thinking caps. Fellas, I got a great idea. Let's put on a show. Yeah. Show? Yeah, that's a great idea. We'll raise three bucks in no time. Yeah. But where are we going to have the show? Oh. I know. Let's get some of that money. Yeah. 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 Yeah
But are there any... Ay, 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 ay. That would be appropriate if you were speaking Axl Rose, but there is no ay, 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 in Bob Dylan. Okay, let's uh, move on to our homework assignments from last week. We we're trying whole sentences. Uh, let's see. The boot heels of the bureaucrat has crushed the lady's Siamese cat. Um, Meaning. The booties of the bureaucrat crush the Siamese cat. Uh, close, close, close. But remember the Doppler effect. It's not Siamese cat, it's Siamese cat. Okay, cat, cat, cat. Very good, everyone please. Cat. cat. Very good. Uh, let's move on to the next one. The War Machine plays Death's Tambourine by the River Stream. Uh, Roger. Uh, the, the War Machine. Plays Death's Tambourine. 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 By the River Stream. Very good, very good. Everybody, River Stream. River Stream. 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 Excellent. Now let's watch this handy visual aid. I'm VJ Grungy. That was Bob Dylan with E. Next up is our classic rock segment. It's a brand new hit by The Doors. Check it out. Parmentier is about to attempt a four-foot putt, which, if successful, will earn him the first-place trophy in $25,000. Dale has lined up his shot, and he's ready to attempt what could be the most important putt of his life. Oh, will he do it? Dale has a history of choking at the last moment, but today could be different. He looks ready. He's gonna do it. Oh boy, here he goes! The 
putter's back. He hits it. It's going, going. Oh, he missed. He choked. He choked. Oh, I can't believe it. $20,000 down the toilet. Boy, does he suck. Choked again, Dale. Give that man the Heimlich maneuver. Are you copying $25,000? Come on, I'm going to get you. I'll show you what I'm doing. I'll overreact to you. You want to see overreaction? I'll oh. blow come back oh. here. I'm going to get you. Oh. And the golfer chases him with the golf club. Uh-huh. Yeah, or maybe he could be a, be a surgeon. Good afternoon, doctor, the guy who overreacts to everything. The patient is ready. Very good, nurse. Scalpel? Scalpel. Now, what do you see? We remove this appendix. Whoa! There's a lot of stuff in here! Wow! What's that? I can't find it! There's too many things in here! I've got to move some of this stuff around! Oops! I hope he didn't need that! Doctor, that was his kidney! Well, he's got another one of those, doesn't he? Or is it two spleens and, and five rectums or... Oh, you think after 1,200 operations, I'd get used to this kind of stuff! What do I do now? I know! I need another drink! Nurse, tape this guy up and don't charge him for the kidneyectomy! And he runs out of the operating room. Funny, huh? Or, or maybe he could be the president. Excuse me, president, the guy who overreacts to everything. The president of Russia is on the phone. He is! He is! What does he want? Do something wrong at this summit meeting? He's mad because... Oh, he's mad! He's mad! Good God! Yes, he said he's mad at himself for not calling you sooner to wish you happy birthday. Oops. And boom, the bomb explodes because he, he overreacted. Get it? So you think we could uh, do something like that? No. Uh, well, uh, thanks for listening. Hey, anytime, Jeff. <laughs> no, no, no! Ah! Ah! <laughs> no! The 60s. A time of elation and of turmoil. The summer of love the Vietnam War. One musical group burst upon the scene and became the voice of a generation. That group is gone now. And so is the imitation band that played them on Broadway. But there is a way to kind of relive that experience. They're not the Beatles. They're not even Beatlemania. They're Beatle Mania Mania. One, two, three. Hey, you guys know that uh, Strawberry Field song? Oh, yeah, yeah. Flew in from Miami, peach, banana. No, 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 no. That's, that's the Russia song. Oh. Yeah, this one goes, uh, da 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 da, something is real. And da 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 da, good. You know that one? You know? Yeah, yeah, wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Beatlemania Mania. It's three guys who sort of know some of the songs you'll never forget. You say you got a new transfusion. What? You say you want some new solution. Alright, whatever. Hey, what's that uh, chord you're playing there? Oh, yeah. It's a. Uh, put your pinky on. Over there. Alright. Which one are you, anyway? Rex Harrison. I, I thought I was. No, no, you're the other one. Oh.
Beatlemania Mania, coming soon to an Elks Club near you. Here, Artie. We got a partner on Manners. Hey, what do we got here? Hey, hey Stravos, why don't you check out our host main course? It's pure. Oh, well, well, imagine that. Looks like you're in a little trouble, my friend. Having that much dope is gonna get you put away for a long, long time. I got nothing to say to you, man. Well, you got nothing to say to me, Scumble? Well, let me tell you something. Either you tell me who the main man is, or you're gonna spend the rest of your life rotting in some jail cell. I ain't saying nothing. I got my rights. Oh, yeah, you got the rights. You got the right to save your own butt. Tell me what I want to know. Maybe if you play nice, Stravos and me will cut you a deal. Right, Stravos? Mm hmm? But if you don't, you are going to mark this day on your calendar as the worst day of your entire life. Look, Gannon, I don't know the guy's name. I don't know nothing about him. Oh, I see. You just blink your eyes like that broad from I Dream of Genie, and the stuff just appears right in front of you? Is that it? No. No? No? Then what? Come on, Artie. Enthrall us with some of your wisdom. Before I say anything, you gotta promise me I ain't going to jail. Hey, you know I can't do that, sweetheart. I can only tell you, I'm gonna do what I can. Then I ain't saying nothing. You wanna be a tough guy? Fine. We'll see how tough you are spending the rest of your life rotting in some jail cell. Stravos, give me the evidence. Watch your step, that's all. I can't believe it, thought we had him. Could use a burger. You hungry? Nah. No, Bob. Hi, Jim. You need any help? Oh, all finished, Ken. Thanks. Hey, how you doing? Oh, okay. Uh, how are you? Oh, great. Thanks. Hey, how about that big date last night? Uh, well, actually, Jim, it didn't go too well. Really? No, she made a comment about my breath. Ooh, fresh breath, huh? Yeah, yeah that's a tough one. Hey, I know. Here, try a Tourette's. Tourette's? Hmm. Okay. Hmm. You know, they're, they're fresh, they're, they're minty, they're... Tourette's, a new breath mint from Dow Chemical, Bhopal, India. Ah! Hey, how's that breath mint, Ken? They're pretty good, actually. Bite me! Tourette's and new Tourette's with Halcyon. Tourette's, for a really fresh mouth. Cock-a-doodle-doo! We interrupt this program with yet another commercial from Beetle Mania Mania. Every once in a while, there comes a group that can change the world simply with their music. This is not that group. Or the guys who played them on Broadway. Meet Lucky, Sid, and Pokey. Destiny brought them together. And together they are Beatlemania Mania! <coughs> Sorry, I'm getting a cold. This is what people are saying about Beatlemania Mania! Excuse me, excuse me, what did you think? Oh, uh, it was really, it was really warm in there. I laughed, I cried, and I cried, and I cried more. And... Do I get any money if I say I liked it? No? I loved it. I thought it was better than Cats. I'm going to go and see it two more times. I mean, when the Phantom came down that stairway, I just... Beatlemania Mania. Huh? Oh, that piece of shit. Yeah. Beatlemania Mania. See it before the reviews come out.
period. No, exclamation point. I have to arrive at the side to end my life and stop the full time. That's not good. Um, the non stop. Now that sucks. Get it. Let me just see what's on the radio. WPMS now begins its broadcast day. We've got the music when you've got your friend. WPMS! Yes, you're tuned to WPMS. I'm Janice Martell, and good morning to you. That is, if having cramps and swollen breasts is your idea of a good morning. It's 6 a.m. on Wednesday. Wednesday for some godforsaken reason is all requested on WPMS, so I have to open the phone lines. What? Um, hi. Is this WPMS? That's right, genius. Do you have a request? Um, yes. Could you play that Elton John song, The Bitch Is Back? No, I hate that song. What? Uh, hi, Dennis. Uh, my name is Ken, and it's my birthday. <laughs> I don't care! What? I like to hear ye! No! We'll be right back after these messages. Mom, can I talk to you about something? What is it, dear? Well, it's one of those heavy days and the... Yes? Oh, God! Pamela? Are you in there? Pamela! <sighs> Producer's never around when you need them. Everybody's late around here. It's a good thing I'm not. Where the hell is Sandra? She's Hi. I'm really sorry that I'm late, but uh, none of my pants would fit. Well, hurry up. The break's almost over. Use it on those not-so-fresh days. We're back on 98.6. Go with the flow on WPMS! Time for the news with Sandra Norris. Sandra? Jeez, is it hot in here or is it me? No, oh, I'm sweating too. Pamela, if you're in there, turn the damn heat down. Thanks. I'm Sandra Norris with WPMS News. We have a little friend visiting us this week, Janice. Tell me about it. Yes, England's Princess Di is here in the United States to raise money for her favorite charity the International Society to Fight Water Weight Gain. The princess was seen at a fundraiser in New York City where she appeared, uh, 
puffy and uncomfortable. Fascinating, Sandra. You got any more news there? Yes. Only I... I don't feel like talking about it right now. Back now to all request day. What? Hi there, Janice. Can you play that Bellman Brothers song, Let Your Love Flow? No. What? Uh, hi! Am I on the air? Not anymore. What? Don't you use that tone of voice with me. Oh, well, finally, a caller I can relate to. What can I do for you? I want to hear the song, Time of the Season by the Zombies, and I want to hear it now. All right, no problem. Would you like to dedicate it to anyone? No. Everyone can go to hell. <laughs> okay, here it is on WPMS, Time of the Season by the Zombies. It's a time. I remember this song. I remember it from my senior prom. I went with Bobby Toronto. I had a crush on him since sophomore year. And this is the song that was playing when I saw Bobby. And I saw him kissing Anthony Spazzacchini. Oh my God, the captain of the football team and the man I was in love with. Oh, there they were making out behind the punch bowl. And I just stood there. There was nothing else I could do. Oh, God, Bobby was the most humiliating experience of my entire life. I hate you, Bobby Toretto. I hate you. Why did you have to pick prom night to come out of the closet? <laughs> That was Time of the Season by the Zombies. Um, it's 610, and I'd like to play a song and dedicate it to all those loyal listeners out there. It's the Rolling Stones with Let It Bleed. From the producers of a lot of movies who have wacky chicks screwing around and killing people. It's a new excursion in terror. Honey. What is it, dear? I'm going to the store. What? I'm out of cigarettes. I'm going to the store. So, you're leaving me? Just for a minute. If I can't have you, no one can. I'm just going down to the corner I've got to. You know, I was thinking of giving up smoking. The basic, fatal, single white temp who rocks the cradle. It's open. A pizza delivery. Uh, put it anywhere. Uh, that'll be six dollars and forty-three cents, ma'am. Thank you. And, uh... Keep the change. Well, thanks. Where are you going? Um, out to my car. I have more deliveries to make. Don't you find me attractive anymore? Well, yeah. You think you can just come in here, drop off your little pies, and never see me again? I have to go. If I can't have you, no one can. The basic, fatal, single white temp who rocks the cradle. She really hates guys. Excuse me. Will that be important or domestic? Excuse me. Domestic. Excuse me. 
I really need some service here. Yes, ma'am. I'll be with you in just a moment. I really need some baloney. Yes, ma'am. I just have to take care of this gentleman first. I will not be ignored. Look, lady, if you just wait your... How would you like mustard or mayonnaise on that? If I can't have that baloney, no one can! Here's your receipt. Thank you. No more wire hangers. Ever! She's the basic fatal single white temp who rocks a cradle. She's, uh, uh, nuts! Check local listings. sharing body hair and producing milk and giving live birth to our young and it's a well-known fact that mammals are part of the animal kingdom so it's a small step from there to determine that because human beings are mammals we are also animals thus rendering your statement completely inaccurate oh sorry right kill him kill him Hello, I'm Sally Struthers. I'm here today for a very special purpose. While many Americans enjoy the freedom to live, grow, and be happy, there are some of us who are not so fortunate. No, it's not the inner city urban dwellers or the starving children in Africa. It's something much closer to home. It's the little bastards. The little bastards, they're not much different from you or I. They are, however, fed up with the aimlessness of life, the hopelessness of mankind, and the battered, non-stop airplay of Whitney Houston songs. thrown out of his house by his parents. Now he has no money, not even to fix his car. Hi, Rich. I bet you could use $100,000, couldn't you? It may not be noticeable by the general public, but these poor folks are on the brink of losing their cable. It may be turned off. They can't afford to keep it on. But with a small donation from you, say $10,000, they will be able to enjoy the luxury of cable television for, for maybe two more years. This is Mikey. Because of a little bad luck, and a lot of bad gambling, he has run into some financial difficulties. 
If he does not get some money soon, he may have to get a job. Hey, more beer. Sit on Santa's lap, honey. There you go. Yeah. Now, we're not looking for your time or your love. We need your cash. A thousand dollars a week will take the needy, us, into the world of comfort and leisure. The way we've always expected we would be. And now, to show you just who we are, Here's a song that sums it all up. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you The Little Bastards. Some say that mankind can live in peace and harmony. But just turn on the evening news and this is what you'll see. Calamity, catastrophe, misery. That's right, we hate the world. We hate everyone and everything. We hate you and you and you and especially you. Now we don't hate you because you're black or white or red or yellow. No, we hate you because you're people. And now we all know that deep down in our hearts, people suck. They lie, they rob, they cheat, they steal. And some people don't even wash their hands after going to the bathroom. I hate those jerks who call me on Saturday at 8 o'clock in the morning and try to sell me insurance. And fat guys in white jumpsuits impersonating Elvis for a living. And anybody who chews with their mouth open. And those idiots who write, wash me on my car when I've been too damn busy this year to get it washed. So the next time you're thinking to yourself, wow, I really hate this guy. Don't worry, because we probably hate him too. So come on, everybody, sing! 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 Oh. And you, and you, oh. yeah. <laughs> please. 
send a donation, send it certified so that you can make the lives of a few. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Oh, you two cut it out for God's sake. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh,